What's up, YouTube? I'm back with Beyond Bent Productions. Good morning, good evening, good night, wherever you're at. Uh, classic diesel designs. We just done the fuel heater delete, which is this little piece up here. Uh, pretty much, you take your housing apart and break off the top, punch it out from inside out, and the plate will actually fall out. We're not good to plate. All right, that's your plate. This little piece is stuck up with the diodes for your plug. It sits on top of the housing and it's usually always leaking. So, broke it off, broke the seal loose. Pop that out, pull the plate out. And you take your tap and you tap out so there's no threads in there. Make sure it's straight. Tap it out and then bam, there you go. That's how you did the delete. Cause I couldn't find any videos on it. I would have recorded it while I was doing it, but it was kind of a pain in the butt. Breaking that little piece off. But yeah, 9 16 wrench. Put it on the back of that tap. And just take your time. Turn a few times and back off. Turn a few times and back off. To get about halfway down. Because you don't want to thread it all the way through. You don't want your nipple to go all the way through. You want it to stop eventually. So that's what that one did. So... That's the classic diesel, diesel fuel heater delete. And that's all it is. That's pretty cool. Now you can cut that wire off. I gotta get enough fuel filter here in a minute. So we're about to slap that on. Put the radiator in. And uh, throw this, all this shit back together. So hit that like button, smash that subscribe button. We'll get this thing running. Oh yeah, this is the original one. Look at this. It's still got the international on bottom. That's pretty cool. So, but yep. If not, I got another housing in there. I got a couple of housings. I go with that one. Oh, let me go grab my other one. Hold on. Oh, I love that pause button. This one, I got a little threaded nipple to go in there. Okay, I like you can see. I got a thread nipple to go in that one, but it pretty much has. I guess this is your return line or your main intake. This one would replace that one, and it has doesn't have this. This truck I think was made it was made up for northern conditions. Cause most of them didn't come with the fuel heater on top. You could have it deleted. So I think this is what this is already. But it's a little rusty, and dirty. I need longer bolts to put that one on because all this one has is the short bolts. So the bolt housings are different compared to short bolt to long bolt see that one is definitely longer than the other when it bounces up to the plate so see how long the bolts have to be so I don't have bolts this long so that's not an option right now that's it there it is we're gonna throw this bad boy on we're gonna fuel filter start putting stuff back together and see if we can crank this damn thing up Customer and get his truck back. All right, peace out. Hit that like button, smash that subscribe button. Put the headlights in too. Those headlights. That's what's going in. So, all right, man. Peace out.